How to buy Bitcoin on Coinbase Easy 2022 Tutorial Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I bring you back with yet another crypto video. So, I hope you all are doing great. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can buy Bitcoin on Coinbase. Now, let me tell you a bit about Coinbase and what it really is. Coinbase is the most consumer friendly and one of the greatest platforms in where you can buy any type of cryptocurrency you want. If you're a starter and you're a beginner with cryptocurrency and you just want to buy some or invest in some, I'm telling you Coinbase is one of the best places you can do that. So I'm just going to guide you through the whole video. I'm going to take you through with the easiest steps. And do not worry, this may seem complicated, but crypto is very easy to get along with. So I'm just going to take you to the end of this. And by the end of this video, you will be able to invest or buy into crypto easily. So let's get right into it. So first of all, what you're going to need to do is create a Coinbase account. Go to Coinbase.com. Over here, you're going to create your account. You're going to get yourself verified. You're, once you've done all that, all the basics, you're going to fully set up your account. You're going to add a payment method, buy your first crypto, all the main stuff. And once you're fully set it up, fully accessible. So now what you're going to need to do is when you're at home, in your home, this is your main interface. Okay, over here, you can see your funds. Obviously, over here, I don't have any funds at the moment. So you can see your funds. If you come down here, over here, you can see latest news regarding any type of cryptocurrency. You can even see information regarding cryptocurrency that Coinbase provides you itself. And uh, on the right side, you can see the top movers of cryptocurrency like this one, Rary Governance Token, which is going for this price right now. And Cardano, which is going for this price right now. You basically see information on the main home interface. Now, when we go to the assets tab, here is where you're going to see your invested cryptos in or the cryptos that you have bought, the crypto assets that you've bought. Now, obviously, I don't have any and you're going to see this as well. If you're a beginner, you're not going to have any crypto over here. So what you're going to do is we're going to go on trade in the third bar. And when we go with trade, we're going to see all these different types of cryptocurrencies and obviously there are a lot that we're already familiar with like bitcoin ethereum tether bnb binance usd so basically these are all the cryptos and we can also set what kind of category we want to see so if i want to see the top gainers i'm just going to click on that now as i went to the top gainers here we can see that rary governance token is the top gainer nowadays and cardano is the second top gainer and uh, if we go on tradable assets, if you want to, you can just click on that, wait for it. And there we go. Bitcoin is the most tradable asset. Obviously, it's been going amazingly in these past few years. So now here's to buy it. Now, obviously, before buying any type of cryptocurrency, you want to know how it's doing in the world and what it's really about. You want to know the information of it, the gist of it. Don't worry, you won't need to go to a new tab and search the type of crypto you're buying. You can just go here. Click on Bitcoin right there. And once you do that, it's going to give you the whole overview of Bitcoin, as you can see. So it's going to show you the currency of Bitcoin going in your fiat currency, in your national currency. And uh, you can also check how it's been. The graph has been going for an hour or the recent day or the recent week or in the recent month, the recent year or all time. Obviously, if we go all time, Bitcoin has obviously just risen and it's been going amazing. So you can just check by that any type of cryptocurrency and how it's doing. What I love about Coinbase is it also lets you know the trading activity, the cryptocurrency. For example, right now it shows that Bitcoin, 95% users are buying Bitcoin and only 5% are selling. So it shows that if you're a seller, there are a lot of options for people. There are like, if you sell, a lot of people are there to buy your assets. So this is basically the overview. They're going to show you different information about Bitcoin. Bitcoin is the world's first widely adopted cryptocurrency. And then if you go down here, you're going to see the top stories regarding that cryptocurrency. So this is how it's amazing. And uh, this is why I love Coinbase for cryptocurrency. So moving on, now let me show you 
the main topic of the video. So we're going to go back on trades and now I'm going to show you how you can buy Bitcoin. So when you click on buy, obviously I don't have uh, my identification verificated right now. But you're going to make sure that you're going to have this verificated. So when you go on buy, it's going to give you a verification error. So what you're going to need to do is we're going to go on the top right. We're going to click on the profile. We're going to go to settings. Now, once we go to settings, we're just going to go to payment method and in add a payment method, you're going to see different methods here. You're going to see PayPal. You're going to see credit debit card like I am and you're going to see bank account. So obviously, if you go into credit debit card, you're just going to add your information and you're going to add your card and it's automatically going to add your card. You can add your PayPal and it's going to automatically add your PayPal. At the moment, I think PayPal is only used for withdrawing. I don't think you can deposit from PayPal yet, but in the upcoming near future, hopefully Coinbase and PayPal will team up and uh, we will be able to deposit our money as well. Uh, the tricky part is when we use the bank transfer. Now, when you put in your bank, it depends on the area you live in because Coinbase has to verify and assure that the bank that has been put in is your bank. So what it says is that it gives you a price regarding where you live. For example, if you live in USA, it will give you around a $2 fine. It will say that you need to send these $2 from your bank to the Coinbase and Coinbase will give you their information. You just need to give those information to your bankers and the bankers will need to send a $2 fine to Coinbase. And that's how Coinbase will verify that the bank account that you have provided is actually yours. So once you've done all that, all the complications have been set aside, you're going to go back to Bitcoin. You're going to click on buy. Once you do that, it's going to open a menu like this. And here you're just going to put in any type of currency that you want to buy with Bitcoin. So for example, if I put in this currency right now, this is in my fiat currency. So I put in this currency and obviously it's going to take this currency out of my wallet. And uh, the fun feature about this is the currency I put in. If I click on BTC and click on this arrow, it's going to convert this currency into the crypto Bitcoin. So basically this currency of mine can buy this much Bitcoin. And it can also go vice versa. For example, if I cut this out, if I want to buy one Bitcoin, now, if I convert this to my currency, it shows me that it's this much in my fiat currency. And once I do this over here, it just says buy. And once you're going to buy it, it's going to ask you to verify your place that you want to withdraw the money from. Once you've done that, it's going to put all the money right in to your assets. Once you go on assets, you're going to see here the amount of crypto that you've bought. And it's just going to be highlighted in orange just to show you that you've actually bought that crypto. So that's basically the gist of it. And that's how easy it is to buy any type of cryptocurrency on Coinbase, preferably Bitcoin, because Bitcoin is going great. So that's how easy it was. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, do let me know if you have any issues with this. Do let me know in the comments. Please don't forget to like the video. Do not forget to subscribe, share this video with your friends and families, and uh, please tell me if you want any more content like this. I hope you all have a great day, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.